Welcome back, all you beautiful crafters. We are back today. Uh, we are here in Inkscape, and we are going to do a tutorial for offsets. It really is super easy to do. There are a few steps um, that can seem a little daunting, uh, but it really is super easy to do once you get the hang of it. With most everything else that we do in our craft, once we get the hang of it, it becomes much easier to do. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and get it started. First thing we're going to come over here and do is click on our text. And right here we're going to type out our name. So uh, we're going to do simple chain. And then come back up here and we're going to click our select button. And this allows the arrows around our name to pop up. And we're going to resize chain. Okay. All right, we're going to click on our text, and up here in the left-hand corner, you can see uh, your font. So we're going to change the font. It decided to act funny there for a minute. So left-hand corner, font, we're going to change the font, and I love Countryside. Uh, you can find this font on defont.com. So there it is. It's one of my favorite fonts. You're going to come up here to Path. And you're going to click Object to Path. Okay. And then you're going to come down here. You can right click and come down here to Ungroup. All right. And then we're going to hit Union. We're going to come up here to Path after we've ungrouped and we're going to hit Union. Okay. And then if you hit Path up here at the top again, and you come down here for almost all the way to the bottom, you can see linked offset. You can click on that. Beautiful, isn't it? All right. So my internet, for whatever reason, seems to be keep seems to keep kicking in and out. So I had to start over. So we're back with the um, when we went to path and we did the linked offset. So you can see the diamond's still there. So what, what the other thing I was going to tell you is if you click on this diamond, you can just drag it like I did previously. If you uh, hover over this diamond and you click shift, you can drag this diamond. Let's see if we can click on it. And it'll be, the offset will behave a little better. The other thing you can do also is hit control and your parentheses uh, or 9 and 0. And it brings up the uh, path, and it will reduce nine, control 9, or it uh, will reduce control 0, will enlarge again. So either one of those will help. So our next thing that we're going to do is, if you see on the inside right here, we have some of these uh, empty spaces. If you want to get rid of that, you can go to Paths, we're going to go to Break Apart, and then we're going to Path and Union, and there we go, it's all gone. So now, we are going to come up here to Path. And we're going to hit link to offset. Click on this, my dear. There we go. And we're going to do link to offset. And if you notice, if you click link to offset again, another box pops up with another diamond up here. And we're going to click another color. You can click the color beforehand. And I'm going to hit shift. I'm going to drag this diamond, and there you go. Now you have a whole other offset. You can do as many as what you want. Uh, when you're done and you like it, you can come up here to File. And we're going to Save As. There we go, and we're going to type in our file name. You can save it as an Inkscape SVG or just a plain SVG. I don't know why. I always do plain SVG. And you can hit Save. We'll be right back and I'll show you what it looks like when you pull it into Cricut Design Space. We are back here at Design Space and I'm going to click on New Project. 
I'm going to come down here to upload. We're going to upload an image, browse, and I'm going to search for an image. There it is. No cleaning up to do because this is an SVG that we've already made. It's was saved as an SVG, so you're just going to name, uh, create any kind of tags. We're going to save. All right, there it is. We're going to pull it into our canvas. And there it is. All you need to do is come up here. You can see that there are several different uh, cuts to be made. So we're going to ungroup them. There's our name. There's our first offset. There's our last one. I do not know where this one come from. So <laughs> we're just going to delete that one. All right, there you go. Simple and easy as that. You just move them around however they, you want them to sit. Simple and easy as that. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Uh, if you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. They turn blue. It's like magic. What, what? And we'll see you back in our next video. Thank you. Bye, y'all.